are in the middle of Denver. Wait, we're not in Denver, are we? Who are you? I'm John. Yeah, this is my dad, and he's going with me to put on the dance floor because he's such a big fan, right? I got all their albums. So what do you love about Blood on the Dance Floor? Um, the music, the music. It's, yeah, it's great. it gets your body bumping. It get, it, I can't control myself. <laughs> I've always heard that, that Denver is it's cold, there's snow, there's mountains. I don't see any fucking snow in any mountains anywhere. This is uglier than Nebraska. By the way, my dad taught me to curse. <laughs> He's cool though. He likes Blood on the Dance Floor. I do like Blood on the Dance Floor. So. I'm bewitched by them. <laughs> oh! Dad, I think a lot of our viewers wonder what kind of music we listen to when we're on the road. Should we show them? Oh, absolutely. So dad, we are uh, literally in the middle of nowhere. Look at this. There's just nothing. Except that bird, you, and that really nice hotel over there. Mountains! So we're in downtown Denver, and there's Coors Field, which is where the Colorado Rockies baseball team plays. And uh, Turn right on Blake Street. Shut up! I'm talking. God, I hate that bitch. Anyway, um, you excited for? Uh, it's pretty downtown, huh? It's pretty downtown. It's pretty downtown. Unlike us. <laughs> it's the legendary baseball player. Not really Shu Hu. It actually even says the player. And there's a sports bar and grill. And there's a homeless person trying to get money from another homeless person. Ah, there it is, guys. Blood on the dance floor. Dad's a little disappointed because we're looking for hooters, but instead we found haters. So, Dad, we're back. We're literally walking to the tour bus. How do you feel right now? Are you shaky inside? I'm shaking. I'm so excited. You're Let's excited. Do Let's do this. There's Brian! Oh, Brian! Oh, hey! Oh my God! Hi. Nice to meet you. Are we gonna be on your show? Yeah. Oh my god. Oh, nice to meet you. Oh my god, oh, I watched I call hugs next. I call okay, hugs okay, next. Okay, okay. Alright, alright. <laughs> Yeah, I see how it is. <laughs> well, dude, see, I just, I just embrace me. You get all dressed up to, you know, what do you really look like? Is the question, right? What? I look fucking beautiful. <laughs> I look beautiful as a man when I first wake up in the morning. I look fucking beautiful now as a female. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Girls, boys, all oh, they love me. I ain't scared. <laughs> and I'm sure everyone loves you and your little arrow pastel. You know, it, uh, it works, right? So. Yeah. I don't think I could pull this off, honestly. No? I think you're a little too fat. Yeah, that's probably it. Or I'm just so muscular, you know? Yeah, because you're oh so fucking huge. <laughs> I'm so intimidated. We should arm wrestle after. No, my hand's broken, actually. Exactly. No, I really <laughs> I'm not even shitting you. I know, so we should arm wrestle. It's really fuck. How did you break it? Uh, fisting incident. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I did that once. You did fisting? Oh, yeah, yeah. I, I had a, a fisting incident. Who were you fisting? I don't remember. I was pretty drunk. Was it a girl or a guy? I don't remember. I was pretty drunk. <laughs> <laughs> was it even of the human species or like what? You know? It wasn't a farm. Just kidding. <laughs> ah! Actually, no. can I have that camera real quick? <laughs> no, 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 Show me the bus. Like, what, what what we got in here? What the fuck do you want to see, man? I want to ever see everything. This is the drivers. This is uh, the fucking living room. It's TV. Uh, there's fucking Xbox right here. I think there's a... I have a blue light. There's a PlayStation in the back, too. There's all kinds of fucking crazy shit in this bus. Kitchen. All back through there, that's Bunk Alley. That's uh, for the Forbidden... The Forbidden Wing. The Forbidden Wing? Yeah. You got this teddy bear, is that yours? Right there? Yeah, someone just brought that to us today. Oh, that's and, uh, sweet. I think it's absolutely adorable. <laughs> it's probably one of the best presents I've gotten in a while. Yeah. He has no arm, and he got, it looks like he has a glitter bullet wing <laughs> in his head. And his head is falling off. Yeah, it looks like David Bowie shot him in the head, huh? Wow. <laughs> he's had a rough... He's like bleeding out of the eye. 
right? Wow. Did you did you do that to the bear after you got it? No, I didn't. It came like this. Okay. And like a likely story. Yeah, right. <laughs> You should get a before and after shot of what you look like on the bus and what you're going to look like on a dog. <laughs> well, but that goes both ways. No, it doesn't. Yeah. I know it doesn't. Well, you've already got a black eye. So I only go one this. way. Okay. <laughs> so, uh, are those your flowers? Some, someone get that for you? Yeah. Oh, my God. These are awesome, right? That's an orchid. Oh, no. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> So I have I have money placed on a bet that uh, this won't last till the end of the tour. Are they like actually still alive? They look like they're about they're to die. They're really alive in the blue man and shit. Wow. <laughs> there was only like two of them, and then now there's like eight. Or something. <laughs> How many that is? I don't know. I and you've got this nice rainbow thing. Rainbow thing. Did you choose the colors on that? With the light. No. Uh, yeah. Whatever that is right there. Oh, we just rented this shit. Oh. Okay. Yeah. No. They, might have, they hooked you up. <laughs> yeah. You're gonna buy a bus. That's fucking retarded. If that shit breaks down. Yeah. Oh hell no. That shit ain't covered. <laughs> you got uh. You got curfew. What time's your curfew? Ten o'clock. It's pretty early, dude. Where do you see that? It's up there. Nah. That's curfew letting us know that like the show has to be over by ten o'clock. Oh. So curfew, bus calls one a.m. Curfew in that city. Mm -hmm. It means the like, kids have to be out of the venue by ten. So what do you think Dobby's doing right now? Putting on eyeliner, or something. Or something. You guys ever fight? What? You guys ever fight? Me and Dobby? Yeah. Actually, no. We get along pretty well all the time. How about Leo's and Virgos work really well together? It's a good as long as you realize that it's a team, mm -hmm. that's all I need to know. Yeah, I mean, it's just you guys just have to split most of the money, just you two. So, I mean, most bands have to split it five ways, and you guys get to keep it just two people. Yeah, they like goes a lot of it. Goes Oh, look who it is. Hey, hey, hey. It's darkness. I'm going to go whiz. All right. I'm going to go whiz. <laughs> <laughs> well, okay. So, during the video, we're going to try and get Dobby to say the word penis five times. Okay. That won't be hard. He heard that? Yeah. But he doesn't know. So, all you watching, got to be counting. You know, it is won't be hard. Is that a burn mark on your nose? Did someone put your like their cigarette on in you? Yeah. Or what? I got in a fight with a, a guy who was smoking after I fisted him. <laughs> He wasn't very happy. I wouldn't be happy if you were fisting me either. <laughs> yeah, you probably couldn't take it. Nah, I just, if the lights went on, I'd freak. <laughs> well, you probably don't have much to worry about. Unless, unless I'm drunk. Um, I'm not intimidated Napoleon Dynamite. <laughs> Jeffree Star wannabe. <laughs> I'm totally Jeffree Star. Do you like Jeffree Star? Yeah, we just hung out in West Hollywood. Yeah? Yeah, he came to our show. Yeah, I tried to interview him, and it was like two years ago, and he said no. Because he's smart. <laughs> You're dumb? No, but all of our fans like you. Yeah. And all of our fans watch your show. That's yeah. the only reason. Yeah. <laughs> well, same. Hey. Likewise. What's up, man? Good day. Hey. He's, he's giving me so much shit right now. Yeah, that's that's his job. He's Satan. <laughs> this is uh, Yin Yang, right? Yeah, basically. Cool. Welcome to the show, man. It's a pleasure to finally meet you. Well, it's an honor to be here. Thank you for having us. We were wondering, what were you doing back there that took so long? I was masturbating. Oh, that's what we thought. <laughs> whatever. Guy, girl, whatever. Masturbates. That's right. That's what you got to do on the road, right? <laughs> well, let's get into it. You ready? You ready? Yeah, whatever. He's probably nervous. He's on the biggest show of oh his God. life. <laughs> oh, yeah, right? Bring it. I don't want to lose my virginity right away. This is so t too soon. Oh, yeah. I'm not ready for this. He's ready. It's a little intense. I'm a little... Blood All right, on, fine, fuck it. <laughs> blood on the dance floor. How you guys doing today? No, fuck off, Brian. Yeah. You probably would. <laughs> you know, I love you, Brian. Yeah? Love you too, man. I don't hate you. I love I you. I love you like a good case of herpes. Well, there are, you know, sometimes... I love you like a fat kid loves cake. I love you like a 62-year-old gay man loves a dildo. What about your dad? That awkward uh, moment. That awkward <laughs> moment. Awkward turtle. <laughs> Well, guys, um, blow on the dance floor. We got to start with this porn star name. Future career for you, probably. So, yeah. Oh, what's it gonna be? Yeah, you can do it. Yeah, yeah. right after you sell out too. <laughs> <laughs> right. What's your porn star name? Davi Inferno. Davi Inferno. <laughs> yeah. What's your catchphrase? Another one bites the dust. <laughs> that's good. That's good. What's yours? Catchphrase. Yep. What's your, I forgot. What's your name? Your porn star name. No, oh, no, I would keep my real name. Oh, okay. My pickup line, if that's what you're asking, I just walk up to every person and say, hey, want to fuck until I get a yes. 
Okay. Yeah. How many people is it going to take, you think? I don't know. It's only taken me maybe one or two, and I usually end up having a threesome with both of them. I've never seen this guy wow. denied ever. Really? Yeah. I mean, well, he, even straight dudes, like the most straightest dudes. And I was like, do you fuck what? So s straight guys go gay for you? Yeah. No, they, they go J for me. Oh, <laughs> zing. Um, who's bleeding on the dance floor? Oh, you're about to, motherfucker. Yeah, it's to our haters. We make our haters bleed. Yeah, yeah. Is he as tough as he acts over here? Oh, yeah. Look yeah? at his hand. <laughs> oh, my. Yeah, how did you break your hand? Um, I told you, a fisting oh. incident. That's right, that's right. Yeah. Is this true? Yes. Who's, Who's missing me? <laughs> What's your problem, dick? Hey, that's why broken. <laughs> what, you never had gay people on your show? No, I'm just kidding. Yeah, dude. Yeah, you know, just for the record, I am straight. I love titties. They're the best things in the world. Just <laughs> them in my mouth. No, really, I, I can't live without boobs. Yeah, dude. Like, we should start a boob group. A boob group. On Facebook and just... Ryan Stars and Dobby love poops. Love boobies. And then Jay in the background, like... Not me. Talk. You guys love boobs too. Do you like boobs? I love tits. Yeah, everyone loves tits. Oh, yeah. so. I get around a lot with tits just because I'm gay, so I get away with just groping them, and squeezing them, and sucking on the nipples. And it's card. You know, like, easy access girls are like, oh, you're gay, play with them. And I'm like, dog, how do I do it? <laughs> and then you go over and it's like, eh. and it's oh, like, no, girls are like, Tavi. <laughs> One more We're time. Like, He's cute. Come here. Tavi <laughs> um, did it. A couple girls wanted to know, did it hurt when you fell from heaven? Oh yes. Yeah. I fell through all the clouds. Yeah. All the water. Yeah. It felt like putting lotion on my skin. Mm, I see. <laughs> uh, you know, I don't know. This guy is divine. Oh, well, and and, and this uh, guy you need to talk to. A lot of a lot of fans, Jay, wanted to know, did it hurt? Did it hurt when you burst through the crust of earth from the depths of hell? What? No. No. Didn't hurt. Didn't hurt when you fell the ugly tree. No, didn't hey. hurt at all. Hey, hey. <laughs> we're getting along so I'm sorry, well. I got zoned out for a second. I was like nursing school. Sorry. Wait, what nursing school? A nursing school right there. Jay, I know this is gonna be hard, but oh, no off. pun intended. What's uh, what's one thing you hate about yourself? Is there anything? No. Yeah. Don't learn to hate yourself. You learn to love yourself. That's right. What do you what do you like about Jay? What do I love about Jay? What do you love about Jay? His loyalty, his patience, his wisdom, his power. Yeah. He's very his power. He's very powerful. Yeah. He's very creative. He's like on fire. Man on fire right there. You're pretty powerful. <laughs> Can be. I like turn around and there's Mason. Oh. See tonight. Yeah. At the show. He's pretty powerful. Yeah. He's pretty powerful. You'll see at the end. Um, what do you like about Dobby? What's not to like about Dobby? I like his fat cock. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Uh, <laughs> rams yeah, my throat cool. on stage. Around, I always run around the bus naked. I'm like, I don't give a fuck. Yeah. I'll like literally piss the door open or like I'll be out on the bunk and fucking my like, dick's flopping out everywhere. I'm like, hi guys. Let's talk. Let's have a girl talk. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm fucking butt ass naked. You guys are perfect for each other. Yeah. yeah. That's yeah, awesome. That's, um, that's Haley Rose. She's on uh, Oh, novel. hello. Hi Haley, <laughs> how are you? I'm she's good. Not, she's a girl I wrote Bewitched about. Aww, I didn't know. And that. now we're best friends. Bewitched. Yeah. Yeah. There you go. Um, Jay, since for you, a lot of these will be for you. Roses are red, violets are blue. <laughs> shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. And, uh, <laughs> shut the fuck up. Ah. Uh, <laughs> you guys say that to a girl or a guy? No, roses are shut the fuck oh, up. Oh. Shut the fuck up. Shut okay. the fuck up. Shut oh no the fuck no. Up. If I. Oh, well, for tonight, I'm actually, uh, I bought a girl roses. Oh. And I'm actually taking her in a limo to the fanciest restaurant in Denver tonight. Wow. And uh, I plan on sealing the deal with love. <laughs> and, I, and I'm actually not going to have sex with her on the first date. I'm actually going to be wait a gentleman. I might wait a week or a month, but I really like her. So You'll get around to it. One day. Yeah. But it's not about that. I'm trying to prove a point. There it's about go. love, and it's about experience and connecting with that person. That's the most important thing about love. Absolutely. And the oral sex. I like connecting my. Uh, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> my bum. What do you think he was gonna say? Connecting my uterus. <laughs> yeah, sure. Connecting his uterus. Yeah. Um, Tyra Banks from America's Next Top Model has a big forehead. And you could land a helicopter and a on it. <laughs> and a terrible attitude. <laughs> and she believes that everyone has a signature pose. She's what's right. What's yours? My signature pose. Right now, do it. What is it? 
What's that one that I, I don't? It's kind of. It's not hard. It's more my face than it is anything. Uh huh. I think your pose is like, like, um, like. I don't know. Like my eyebrows kind of up and my eyes are all like this, and then it's just kind of like. You know. On that, yeah. 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 I just do the people's elbow. I'm like. This <laughs> <laughs> mellow. Well, Dobby, it's cooking you jabroni. Corporate elbow. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. <laughs> And my, 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 my pose would be like, Ugh. you know what I mean? Jay's a fan. So <laughs> disgusted. Um, abortion. Were you a model before this? No, I was a hairdresser. Really? I was. Yeah, is that why you do like all this crazy stuff with your hair? It's not crazy, it's artistic. Artistic stuff. There you go. Yeah. yeah bitch. What, could, <laughs> what would you do with my hair? <laughs> what advice would you give me? Tell bitch. Because I just have really curly, you know, hair. You got like Napoleon Dynamite thing going on here. No, you would be so much cuter if you were somewhere else. Anybody in the world. This is really cool. No, it's it's totally like Des Moines hair. Yeah, it's totally like a Brillo pad. <laughs> hey. I, look, I would just like, I don't know. I don't know what you can do with that. You should put some low lights. <laughs> yeah, some low lights. Low lights. I could just grow it out like crazy yeah, and be like a. Please don't. Please don't. It'd be like Napoleon Dynamite. Just be Napoleon Dynamite. Like Napoleon yeah. Dynamite already. I'm tall. I'm famous and, and stupid. I have curly hair. I'm smarter <laughs> than Jay. I'm more inter- virgin. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, hey. You're dating a girl named Yolanda. I'm I'm waiting for the one. Waiting for the one? Waiting for the, the one. The one's never gonna come unless the one is blind, <laughs> motherfucker. <laughs> well trick fell, landed on its dick. A <laughs> trick, please. I wouldn't say that. Weirdest thing you've ever uh Actually I'm not gonna do that one. Sex is awesome. Right? I agree. Yeah? Yeah, what's wrong with sex? Sex is great. I heard Jay doesn't like sex. I don't like hearing disgusting faggots like you talk about the genitalia, so if you could shut the fuck up and not have the sex talk with us, thanks. Next question. Wow, Jay, sex is something you <laughs> save for, um, well, you're kind of, you know, you're kind of young right now, what? but someday. Sex, though. I yeah. mean, if you listen to half our music, it really isn't about the sex. But we love sex. You guys have evolved your clearly. sound, though, like... Um, your older stuff was probably more about sex. It was. It, we have evolved, you're right. Mm-hmm. And it's more about, uh, you know, it's about, there's so many people out there that are living broken lives and we're just trying to fix their lives and we made so many discoveries, that, you know, over the years and uh, now it's about helping them connect with their future and what they want and know that happiness depends upon them mm-hmm. and if we can encourage them to go that route then we're on a righteous path. And that's what we're trying to do. Excuse you, what? What? Hand job? Yeah. Look, we're not going to give you a hand job. Sorry, buddy. <sighs> Damn it. It's not happening. I'm not trying to act I'm not you. into it. I'm not going to give you a blow job either. Sorry. I'm not into Dude. flossing my teeth. I know I look like a girl, but doesn't mean I'm not going to fuck you. Okay. Sorry, honey. It's okay. Not happening. I guess the whole point of this interview is done. <laughs> Just kidding. Um, what the fuck? <laughs> what's your... uh? What do you like about girls, specifically? Um, what do you look for? The, minus the boobies. Um, anybody that's like a nerd like me, I'm into anime mm-hmm. and Final Fantasy, and I'm a nerd. But at the same time, I like to go on adventures and get drunk and travel and have fun and live life to the fullest. So anybody that has a very approach of living life to the fullest yeah. is like I do. Yeah, man. And rumor has it you like big butts. I love asses. Yeah. I love big ass. Yeah. That's what I'm into. How big we talking? Like this big? Not like, like a this fat big? ass. I don't mean nothing fat. That's crazy. Yeah. Just a nice ass. Nice ass. Yeah. What do you look for in a guy? I don't look. Because setting expectations only lead to disappointment. That's fucking wisdom right you there. Know, you, know, okay, you know what the thing is? You have to learn to appreciate the good qualities about the person. And that's why so many relationships are in turmoil right now. People can't even think of 10 things that they're grateful People about that person. Too many standards for I know, themselves. You have to appreciate the love and the gratitude of that person. You have to appreciate that the, the person's smile, the way that person cooks you breakfast, if they cook you breakfast, or they listen to your songs and they're honest, like, that's really good. No, that fucking sucks. Or, you know, job. that morning blow job, and they know how to suck it the way you like it. <laughs> or they get your car ready. Or it's like they make you toast with a little smiley face on it. It's the small things that count. And I do all those things because I love you, man. 
Thank you. I love yeah. you too, Brian. No, yeah. You're a good dude. I know Thank you are. You. I know deep down inside that hard black heart of yours, there is a little <laughs> love little in there. A little boy. A little boy of love in there. Of endless imagination. Trying to connect with someone. <laughs> I connect with you, buddy. All right. All right. We're bros. That's right. We're bros. bros. Right, Jay? Don't touch me. Go, <laughs> go hug a landmine. <laughs> oh my god. I'm gonna put a landmine in your bed tonight. Oh um, <laughs> can we uh, can we don't show off our shoes real quick? Don't shit on the bed. Don't shit on the bed. Look, I have pretty sweet shoes. Yeah, you faggot. You're wearing fucking Nikes. <laughs> Welcome to the 90s, bitch. <laughs> I think these are actually the, the gayest of the shoes here. These are beautiful. Yeah? Yeah, you just hate them because you can't afford it. <laughs> I probably make more than you, buddy. <laughs> no, but seriously, where'd you get those? What? Where did you get them? A lot of crabs. Why did you pick those? Is it is that horses on it? No, bitch. No, they're skulls. fucking skulls. Oh, I look like a horse from here. Very representative. Yeah, representing. <laughs> I don't know. I don't. Mama had to I, I, Mr. I, Ed. I do have a pair of Jordans, but these are these are my tour shoes. I'm like a cowboy banshee. Brian, better idea. New career move. Don't do interviews anymore. Just have everyone fucking roast you, because you're the easiest person to roast. Like you're such a piece of shit. Like I love it. It's Stop being a fat Martino. <laughs> it works out. You know what they say about people who do this? They have low self-esteem, and that's okay, man. I have so much low self-esteem. That's yeah. why there's a huge line of people it's down the block. Life. And yet he still isn't satisfied. <laughs> you know. You know. You know. Um, what's the worst thing you have ever done, Jay? Well, I haven't had sex with you yet, so I guess I haven't done the worst. <laughs> Touche. Oh my god, dude. Right back at you. Oh <laughs> well, I don't want. I don't want to get whatever he probably me? has. So. Yeah, I don't want to fuck this guy. Like it's insane. I don't want AIDS though. Yeah, but the thing is, he wears a condom every time. Oh, okay. <laughs> so you're, you're, you've been tested. Yeah. You're clean. Are you I'm clean. He gets all the time. He asked to. <laughs> <laughs> but what? Well, I, I mean, whatever. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it is what it is. I get laid more than this ugly fuck. <laughs> it's, it's true. <laughs> but it'll probably lead dear to my. <laughs> um, let's see. Who was, uh, were you guys popular in high school? No. No? No, I was popularly hated. <laughs> Why? <laughs> yeah, I, <don't> <laughs> I, I was, I was standing, I suppose. Yeah. So uh, people weren't, oh, sorry, go ahead. No, no, Jay, go. Yeah, well, I mean, what was high school like for you? Um, I didn't go to high school. I went, like, the first week of freshman year and I got expelled. For what? Wearing makeup. You got expelled for wearing makeup? Yeah. I'm from a very small heck town. So, that must have been rough. No, I've had a very, very crazy life. Yeah. Yep. I actually have a lot of respect that you've made it this far, and you're not afraid to be yourself. Thank you. Appreciate yeah, it. Dude. Good for you. It would be nice to you for a little bit. Yeah, it's all good. Now you got to compliment me. I know it's going to be you hard. You have such a lovely figure. <laughs> <laughs> Are you hitting on me? <laughs> With a baseball bat. <laughs> I like it rough. Um, <laughs> let's see. A or actually, this is a true story. In June 2007, a couple in South Carolina fell off the roof of a building um, and died. <laughs> He's so evil. <laughs> <laughs> Who the fuck falls off the roof beside Santa? What are you doing up there? <laughs> you wouldn't do that? Have sex on a roof? Oh, they were having sex on a roof and fell off? Yeah, yeah. Oh. Damn. Yeah. <laughs> they died? Did someone find them like naked and just like all like... Hey, at least they went out with <laughs> in the a snow. Yeah, they At went out with a bang. They went out with a bang. They went out on t well, one of them went out on top. That's awkward. The other one went out on. Who's the top? Who's the bottom? Hmm. Male and female, right? I think so. Yeah, so there was no bottom. Maybe they were experimenting with things. I have no idea. Interesting. We should look that up after. There's still like anal beads <laughs> in his ass and everything. Hell yeah. <laughs> That's how I want to go. Like you I Honestly, I could see you having sex on a roof. I have sex everywhere. Yeah. I don't care. Have you had sex on this area here? No. Yeah. I have courtesy for the people around me when I have sex, but that's he's good. Very, he's strangers. very <laughs> strangers. I don't give a fuck because when I was in LA, I just got my throat railed on a sidewalk. <laughs> like, didn't care. It's like, fuck it, I'm drunk. <laughs> yeah, that's the night you got raped by that Australian guy, right? Yeah. Yeah. Raped by an Australian guy? Not literally raped. Well, I mean, but he like sat on my dick. <laughs> <laughs> There you well, go. It wasn't like, it was he just, slipped and fell on it. <laughs> Oops. He was just really into it. What's your warm up routine? He was really into it. I drink green tea, I yeah. say a prayer, and uh, do you do any like vocal? Little warm -up? jump up, you know, stretch up the muscles, the guns, yeah. the guns. legs, you know. Yeah. Stretch out the balls, you know. What do you do, Jay? I think I like crack almost every bone on my body, and then, you know, um, 
uh, I try to jam with this bitch, you know, for like at least like 20, 30 minutes, you know, for a set. Just a little vocal warm up. Yeah. Just gonna break myself in a little bit for the day. Yeah, dude. That's pretty much it. There's a lot of creative ways you can warm up your voice, too, right? Oh, yeah, no, we do some pretty funny shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm the pervert. <laughs> Just kidding. Um, no, your voice, not your throat. Yeah, I'm a pervert, I admit it. Yeah. I actually, well, I think sucks. I am, too. I'm a nympho. I can't help it. Who can, yeah, I can't help it either. Oh, he brought you flowers. And you know what? I believe in one race, and that's the human race. <laughs> yeah, you should put some positivity in your interviews. Yeah, that's right. I do. There's positive. Like um, what is your... Uh, make the most random noise you can right now. Go. Just make a noise. I don't do what I'm told. Please. I don't do what I'm told. I beg of you. I don't give a fuck. Oh, come on. You can do it. Be like... <laughs> can you do? Would you be willing to do? A noise. No, no, no. You come back later. No, no, I'm not gonna make noise for tell you. Him, you, know. you tell him. Stupid Brian, stop. Make a fucking noise, all right? <laughs> You're gonna hear no choo choos from me. JJ, you can make some no some good noises, right? I just called you JJ. Yeah. I know. I haven't been called that since I was like ten. <laughs> You're uh, <laughs> that was your noise. Yeah, that was my noise. That's, you make that noise a lot. Yeah. <laughs> Call. <laughs> oh, it makes with my mom. Wow. Uh, Mrs. Stars. Mrs. Stars. You should meet Grandma Stars. She would be up to the task. I'm going to make her see stars. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> she would, she won't know. She'll make you see stars. Yeah, I know. Me and Davi want to double penetrate her in her butthole. Oh, yeah. She would love that. I love to, like, <laughs> open up her mouth. <laughs> Grandma Stars is literally the craziest oh. person you ever meet. Right? I'm going to stretch it out. Napoleon Dynamite. I can't She wait. might be the one for you. Uh, I'm so excited. Is she like, in a wrestling match right now? Her. What? Does she like to wrestle? Oh, she yeah, she loves to wrestle. Oh, hell yeah. Oil wrestling? Oil wrestling. wrestling. <laughs> um... Go beat Tina, you fat lord! <laughs> <laughs> um... Just make if we get more internet checks than you do. Why, uh, on a serious note, why do you think you guys are so popular? Because, I mean, you do dress up and you have a lot of haters, but... People really do connect with your music. You're completely missing the point of it. It's not about being popular. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's about doing what you love, and other people love what you do, and that's all that it is. And without those people that are loving what you do, you can't do what you love. So it's like a, it's a, it's a cycle. <laughs> it's the truth. I don't, I don't preach nothing but. Yeah, it's man. Like, what do your fans mean to you? Everything. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I live and breathe them. I honestly, I, I wouldn't be able to wake up every morning without these people. This man sat out in like 30 degree weathers. <laughs> weathers. Weathers. This man. Weather. He sat out for 30 degree weather, just signing autographs for like three or four hours. I mean, that's dedication. And he got sick that night, so uh. you know, he gives a fuck. He cares. And if we didn't, I don't think the success of this band would be where it is if it wasn't for us being so dedicated to our fans. Mm -hmm. And that's what a lot of bands don't understand. No, yeah, dude. No. If you don't give gratitude, okay, yeah. think about it. How can you get love and not give it right back? Mm -hmm. Well, yeah, yeah, you get so much love every night you on get, stage. Like, you get love back to your fans. Yeah, I actually yeah, like a little mistaken following. pictures. I saw your following on Twitter. It's it's getting popular. Yeah. But the, the reason why is because you give the love back. I right? spend hours every day tweeting back to my Remember fans. this. Yeah. In order to get love, you must give love. And when you give love, you know, when you when you give it, it comes right back to you. Yeah, man. It's I actually all for divine power. I respect bands that respect their fans. So you gotta love your fans. They're the ones who make you. CJ, I knew underneath all that, uh, bravado is a really nice guy, right? I am. Yeah. Just not to you. <laughs> <laughs> so, but to most people, you're nice. No, to everyone, I'm super nice. Except me. It's up to you. Okay. I can handle it though. Yeah. Um. What's the message of Blood on the Dance Floor? Like, what do you what do you stand for? Love. Love. Brian. 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 Oh, random tripod here. Love has always been our message. Yeah? Of course. That's the only way we, we can be. That's the, that's how we're raised. So. Yeah, man. Very cool. <sighs> What's the secret to your hair? Secret of my hair. Can you take that hat off and show us your hair real quick? No. He has hat hair. Oh, he has he hat, hat hair? hair yeah. Oh, it's, okay. It's like dreads right now. <laughs> Me too. Hat hair too. No, it's uh, my secret of my hair. I just put, you know, it's like my sex juices in there and then it just stays up there. Is this a pilot's hat? 
Yeah. Yeah. I'm the captain of the ship. Oh, that's cool. I like that. I'm the, I'm, I'm a land pirate. So. You're a land pirate. You know. Arr. Arr. You gotta be fierce Arr. in these parts, my motherfucker. Arr. Are you scared? Yeah. <laughs> There you go, you That's noise. it. I got my more. <laughs> oh, I got my noise. Yes, I tricked him. Motorboat, son of a bitch. That's right. Who's your best friend? Either of you. Oh, Jay. Yeah. Jay. I can't live without Dobby. Dobby. That'd have been bad if you'd said someone else. <laughs> no. Jay. Carol. No. Jay was the first person I thought of. Who's your best friend? Chuck Norris. My my mom. His right hand. No. My <laughs> <laughs> sorry, sorry. Well, sorry. Your date, it's, right? it's actually my left. It's actually sorry. my left hand. Oh. You're left-handed. No, I'm not. Oh. <laughs> I heard if you masturbate a lot, you can get cancer. Well, I'm screwed. I don't Just know. Kidding. Well, actually, you were both screwed. No, no pun intended. Going to hell. Going to hell. <laughs> um, actually, they're trying to make a law to make it illegal to masturbate. I think that's retarded. Me too. You take away masturbation, and you take away life. What are you gonna do all day? <laughs> I never masturbate. Yeah, we have assisted. I will like I will go days without sex and not Haley masturbate. Likes to masturbate me. Hey, is this true? Haley doesn't masturbate. She's total prude. No, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what is what is Dobby like? How do you get? Trying to come to the zipper in a padlock. It's like. <laughs> yeah, what, am I, what am I like? What is Dobby like? Yeah. What is he like? What am I like in bed? It, oh, honey, no. Mm -mm. I don't kiss and tell. No. <laughs> <laughs> I'm right. sure you should what, know. What I mean, like things about just you all the time. tell me things about. <laughs> uh, what do you like in real life? Well, yeah, you know me. You're, uh, you are just a ray of black sunshine. <laughs> that is a great analogy. Yeah. All right. Yep. It's a wild one. What's one. Jay like? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Jay. Jay is just a ray of black. <laughs> no sunshine. No sunshine. Just black. Just blackness. Yeah, I'm. I'm a. I wear black a lot too. You're lying. I actually have. You guys want to see a picture of me when I was emo? You were emo. You were emo. Just for the just Is for that the what night. You call it emo. Right, I'll try and find it. And I'm gonna be the emo judge on this because I grew up with oh, that shit in high school. Here's a here's that a picture. Not emo. Here's a picture of me shirtless. Gross. Yeah. <laughs> Like that, <laughs> you're like, your body's like a pinto bean, and then your, your little arms are like too thick. Yeah, it's so literally, cute. my dick has never been this soft ever. Yeah, in the history my, of my, my life. dick just turned into like a my second dick belly button. Actually, that's a better one. No, I'm not into it. Yeah, no, you know, you like it. Show me the dick. I'll be talk. available later. Here's me when I'm angry. No, that's your date face. Your mouth is open. Let me see, let me see. You're ready for the dick. Oh, right we got the Hulk. <laughs> And Monster Smash! Yeah. <laughs> ah! Ah! <laughs> Alright, that's Brian Star Smash. That's me smashing stuff. And okay, where I gotta be on here somewhere. Oh there I am, okay. <laughs> wow. You look uh, such a fucking you bag. Got and you're still wearing an arrow hey. shirt. <laughs> <laughs> that's the thing to kill. Two black guys and he's trying to be like Eminem. <laughs> hey, don't, don't be jealous. That ain't emo, dude. Don't be je don't be hating. You literally just getting heated up. Trying to be like Eminem. Pulling it off with blue. That's great. <laughs> now, won't the real Slim Shady please stand up? Please stand up. Honestly, please people ask up. me for beauty tips, and I just tell them. I wish I could slip my oh wrist and die right now. I'll just. <laughs> I can help you with that. <laughs> 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 Let's go. I'm just gonna get my keys. Here, hold on. <laughs> Are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. You ready? You ready? Using the wrong side, you queer. <laughs> <laughs> what? I mean business. Things I, are I don't, that, I don't know what's more insulting. Come on, don't you hate me, Brian? Don't Actually, you want me to fucking person. die? I don't want to get sued. Don't Getting you want to kill me? <gasps> I can't even cut people properly. <laughs> Ooh, I have a bruise, dude. <laughs> <laughs> We're, not here. We're here to save lives. Not, That's right. None of that bullshit. Don't cut. Unless yeah. it's Jay, then you can cut him all you want. Yeah, well, I'm telling you right now. If you guys are having a problem, you're not alone. You are the heart that beats inside of me. If you give up tonight, you give up on me. So, take back your life and put down a knife. There you go. Do you want to um, very, very plug in the headphones to make sure it's... it's no, I, but I just want to make sure it's coming through. Really? Only time I did... Are you dad? Yeah, he is. <laughs> I, was like, I was like... That's what I asked. Apparently it's just a sugar daddy named John. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's my dad. 
So he just <laughs> it's good though. But he's he's cool. He doesn't give a shit. Nice to meet you, Mr. Stars. Nice to meet you. Ask him what he thinks of his Is son. Really, your dad? <laughs> you bad. You bullshit me. You're playing John. I know. You're a dick. I just didn't Are want you, you really guys. His dad. Really am. Oh my god. Hey, what the what? fuck were you thinking giving birth to this sinful thing? No, well, I was hoping you'd be a little bit nicer. <laughs> I mean. Say it. Say you're it. Right, whatever. Right. Right. I'm sorry. Why didn't you drown him at birth? <laughs> <laughs> Can I ask oh, your mom yeah. the same question? <laughs> Go for it. She's on Twitter. Go for it. Okay. Mom this and bro. Mm. Oh yeah. Yeah. Mom, yeah. There you go. You have a bigger Jay's following mom, than no, you will. <laughs> I actually am catching up to you, buddy. Please Bring tweet his mom. Um who are you um can you lick your elbow? No, no, I look like You look pretty flexible. I am extremely You're flexible. You're good at licking things. Yeah, I can put my legs behind my head. Never said I could lick my elbow. Thanks. <laughs> can you lick your elbow? Oh, come on, dude. Uh, I, I could never do that. Yeah. Can you hold your own ankles? No. Because you're about to get booked. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, uh, God. I don't know what to do. Let me stumble on something. Describe your manhood with one of your song titles. Huge. <laughs> Is that a song title? Yes. I'm working on it right now. <laughs> Unreleased song. Star Power. Mine's massive. It's a song I'm going to release at some point. What did you say yours was? Star Power. Star Power? That's right. No, you describe your manhood with one of our song titles. No. Mm, bewitched. Bewitched? Because I'll put you in <laughs> it. Also, what does your dick do? Do you, do you hypnotize people with your little one-eyed snake? Oh, yeah. No. It's it's one... I mean... Are you circumcised? Are you sure? Because I thought your dick was called... No, no let's be serious. No. Brian, you're circumcised. Are you? Yes, because my dick doesn't look like a sea cucumber. Are you? No comments. <laughs> I'm, like, I'm like Chevy, like a rock. <laughs> well, at least you know you're not Jewish. Or am I? No, you have to get off the bus now. I'm, I'm the chosen one. If you're, not, if you're not Jewish, you have to leave. I am Jewish for the oh. day. I became one last night. I thought you were a Christian. You Look what he did to this poor bear. I didn't do anything to that bear. We got, it like that. we got it like this. This is, um, our fans did that. Um, That's why you gotta feed them. What do you want written on your... <laughs> What do you want written on your gravestone when you die? I haven't really thought about that. It's hmm. a good question. Yeah, because it could happen sooner you than you think. You on that. I, cur yeah. I curse the man that moves my bones. Oh, mm. that's good. Well, Jay, Jay's got to start thinking about that. Yeah, I'm going to say regret me not, because everyone says forget me not. Oh, regret me not. Regret me not. Look at me now. Look at me now. Oh, look look at me now. Oh, I'm getting paper. paper. We had a moment there, dude. We did. And we did. We totally geeked out together. It was awesome. Uh, Jared on Twitter wants to know, how are you so fucking sexy? Yeah. Who's he talking oh, to? How are, you, how are you so fucking sexy? Yeah, Jay. Who's he talking to? Jay. Yeah, yeah you, you obviously. I don't think I'm... Dude, when you cut yourself, you bleed sex. Like, tell it's, me your yeah. secrets. That's funny. What's your trick? I don't know. This is an androgynous thing. That's yeah. all it is. What you, what you got on your hands here? You got rings? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, buckle. Like crack nails. <laughs> I actually split my nail earlier today, so I have a band-aid. Oh, uh, how far down did you split it? Like to the cuticle? Not too bad, hopefully. Oh. Dude, I fucking I slammed my you can't see it. Yeah. I slammed my finger in his car door when we we're in Florida and I still uh, have a fucking crack down the middle of my Jesus. finger. Ow. It was so gnarly. That's great. That's that was great. So <laughs> um how do you break up with a girl, Dobby? Uh I do it in person and I do it straight up to her face. What do you say? Um, <laughs> straight up, <laughs> straight up. I don't think this is working out. Yeah. I think we need to move on, and uh, you know, I I think this is gonna be better for the both of us. And uh, heard that before. Yeah. It, you know, if you ever get lonely, you can call me. Yeah. You know, I'll, I'll miss you. So you sort know, of. You can always come into my Davi Palace of Love. Davi uh, Palace of Love. Yeah. You is that what room? you call your room? Yeah. You, you want? We'll take a tour. Yeah. At the end, we'll do it. We'll take a tour. All right. We'll take a tour. You guys can show us the bus at the end. Um. There you go. Souvenir for you. What is, uh... Oh, fuck your souvenirs. <laughs> fuck Brian Stars! <laughs> You're welcome for that <laughs> gift I just gave you. What's Okay, on a serious note, guys, what is the biggest misconception about you? <laughs> Where do we start, right? Yeah, right? There's, I mean, if it's not out in the obvious already, I mean, obviously, like, everyone on the internet, like, thinks I'm a douchebag, and they think he's douchebag, and then, like, Watching like the things that he posts like on Twitter and things like that, like you, you follow him on Twitter, right? Yeah, it's of always course, very yeah. inspirational, motivational, like super, like everything's just of course, I get yeah, it. everything's <laughs> like wisdom and everything. You know, it's awesome. And then like I'm like, how do you? 
I don't know. People see us on the street and they see him, and I see the way that they look at him because I I don't get to see how people you look know, at me. You know what's crazy? I really I appreciate it. I admire it because the thing is, of like they're not hating. You ain't doing it right, and that's how I look at it. Like so many people are just full of negativity. Yeah, I have I have haters. Yeah, Brian Sorry has haters. I do. Yeah, I'm not. I've got one right here. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> 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 I've always wondered what my haters looked like. You know, my thing Fucking about it is gorgeous. Like, <laughs> you know, love me or hate me, you still want to fuck me. You know, it's just. That's my motto. I really don't give a fuck. You know what I mean? Yeah, Hi, Jay. That's right. No. I got that in a fortune cookie the other day. <laughs> Love you, um, hate me, but you want to feel fucked. That's what, right. You guys say you have positive music, but how do you feel about, like, you wrote the song Sexting? I think Sexting's a fucking awesome song. It's happy. You, do you encourage sexting? Do I encourage sexting? I do. Yeah. <laughs> Why would I say no? And then I'd like. Sexing is great. Like, anybody that. Are you a prude? I mean. Me? You don't sex? No. Uh, I sex all the time. Uh, no. I. I. I, I sex <laughs> on all the time. I, I do. I swear to God. Do you I'm see? Virgin. My phone's always blown up, and I just Look, gotta. Sexing is. is healthy. Let's see how many missed texts I have sex. since we started. Missed calls and texts. Yeah, phone sex. You guys ready? How many missed calls and texts do I have? None. You're fucking awesome. <laughs> I hear crickets. You're so cool! Hey, but this tidal wave is there for me. Yeah, Teach whatever. me how to be cool just like you. Yeah. How many phone, how many texts do you have? I don't know. I don't, like <coughs> I don't know. I have no my voice. I sound like a chipmunk. Like oh, you have one? But it's is that from your mom? No. Oh. It's my friend Michael. Okay. How many do you have, Dobby? More than I don't know where my phone is. Yeah. I don't give out my phone number. I because I never text. I hate phones. Yeah, me too. I don't fuck technology. I remind her every day. Um, is there anything you have uh, self doubt about? Never. No. I'm no? grateful for everything in my never life. Grateful for the heart, my brains, my body, my bus, my friends, my life, my parents, everything. I'm grateful for it all because without it, I wouldn't be who I am today. I would have nothing. And you have to appreciate every little thing in your life, Mr. Stars. I do. You have to. I love it's my dog. Sweaty. It keeps you warm. It does. Your eyes that let you see. <laughs> your tongue that lets you taste. You have to appreciate everything in life. I do have a yeah, what the tongue does taste. Get your tongue out of here. Get <laughs> that nasty little shit out of here. Um, what's the worst piece of advice you guys ever got? <laughs> you should do an interview with Brian Stars. Oh, I, see, I got someone told me about on the dance floor would be a good interview. Yeah. Yeah. Well, it turns out it's gonna be fucking great. <laughs> it's. I know. It don't get better than this, honey. That's right. You know this is gonna be your most popular interview ever. <laughs> this, this is it. This is it, it. will. You know it will. This is it. Um, did anyone ever? I mean, who told you early on that you couldn't do this? You know. Actually, my mom. Really? Yeah. She, she was said like, you can't do this. You suck at singing and. Uh, yeah, laugh it up. I mean, everybody has their uh, their moments in life where everybody's doubting you, but it's ultimately you. You are the power, mm -hmm. and you are the person that needs to prove everybody wrong. So, what does she say now? I think haters motivate me. She says she's oh, she's like crying on stage. She like she couldn't believe it, and she's she knows that you know I love doing what I do, and she supports it. You know, I mean, my mom wears her T-shirts. She's screaming our name, so. Yeah, it's cool. So like, for you know, from from uh from doubting me to believing in me, it's it's crazy, but I appreciate it. Were Were you bullied in school? Uh, yeah. <laughs> what was that like? Um, miserable. I was like, I don't know. I was bullied to like a really crazy extent, though. Like not just by kids, but like teachers and like staff. Teachers did. Faculty. Uh, it's a a point where like. My mom took me out of school to homeschool me because it was so bad. I just couldn't even go to school today. And it was just like, um, I don't know. Because after I got back, like, because I was homeschooled for like a year, and then she put me back in school. And by that time, I didn't know anybody that was there, so I didn't have any friends. And then I had to get to school like 20 minutes late, and I had to leave 20 minutes early so none of the kids would see me. And I had one classroom every day all day one teacher I couldn't leave the room without a, the police escort that was on campus wow he took me yeah I'm serious and it's like really bad shit my mom like almost got into a lawsuit with the school and everything that's why so, like I never finished high school or did you have a childhood a childhood yeah my childhood was fucked up too <laughs> no, but, you, but you two you didn't really have a childhood it was messed up 
Yeah, no, I mean, I did. I still remember being a kid. I, I had to grow up really fast. Uh -huh. But it's like, um, my childhood, like, at home was awesome. Mm -hmm. My childhood at school, that, that was, like, the only bad part of my life, really, as a kid. Did your mom school. accept you right away for who you wanted to be? Um, I'm sure you, she probably wasn't expecting... <laughs> it's not, like, it's not necessarily who I wanted to be. It's just who I was just becoming on my own. Mm -hmm. And she saw a change, and she was... She didn't really say anything about it for a while, and then my grandmother, because I was pretty much raised by my grandma, and then when she passed away, that's when my mom decided to become way more open. Okay. And I was, like, allowed to be, like, who I am, you know? Yeah. There so you she, like, broke free of all that. But So you really uh, love your mom? Oh, yeah, I do. My mom actually just moved in with me, like, two weeks ago. Wow. So my mom lives with me for a little short period of time. That's, that's good. So yeah. your family's close to you. Absolutely. <clears throat> do you guys think, um... Are you a cocky band? I'm a cocky person. I'm not cocky about, like, my work. Mm -hmm. You're a cocky person? Yeah. What do you mean by that? Like, I present myself as cocky, but I never say anything that's, like, ignorant, I guess. I've never, like, I'm never arrogant about, like, you know, what I do. Never or really like, brags about, yeah. you know, the things that we've, you know, earned or, or our level that we've reached. We're very humble, like, like I said we appreciate every little single thing and the reason why we're you know we are where we are today is because you know we're solely dedicated to the people that made us who we are we haven't signed to our label you know we started our own independent label and that's uh, called dark fantasy records and you know we're just we just do everything independent and uh you know we're these guys have made us who we are and we're never going to forget them or we're going to continue doing it for them and the way they want it to be done so cool man yeah but yeah i think uh deep down you guys are doing something really cool so Thank you. uh a couple more fun ones here these are all sexual because i well let's just be honest <laughs> that's that's what they want to see um it's all good before i go on well actually this one isn't sexual before i go on stage i always get high <laughs> do you yeah yeah how are you i always show love for my people there you go. Um, if the carpet matches the drapes, shave them both. <laughs> <laughs> you agree? Get that shit away from me. There you go. Shave them even. Sometimes when I'm having sex, I make this noise. I growl sometimes. Like how? Like, um, I don't know. Like that? Yeah, kind of a little bit. Wow. It's, a, it's a little bear. It's a little like bearish. Spit on it. <laughs> So you growl. That's how you know you're enjoying it. A little bit. Yeah. A little snarl. A little just... snarl. <laughs> uh, <laughs> <laughs> so that turns people on. <laughs> Are you turned on at home? I don't. I don't think it's. A, it's about. I don't care if it turns anybody on. Like everyone's turned on when their fucking faces in the pillow. Anyways. Whatever. <laughs> I'm sure you're not a little bitch when you're getting fucked from behind. <laughs> like me? me? What, yeah, with titties your, on your back? What is your noise when you make in yeah, bed? Right? What's your noise? Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Woo! You're, yeah. Yeah, do so that to me. Really. Okay, the girl would have ran away by now. Right? No, she wouldn't. <laughs> no, she would have ran away. She's on a away. leash. <laughs> She's on a leash. She's not going anywhere. Um, two dripping wet watermelons make me think of... Blah, blah. What? Plow pops. You got a problem? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> How about you? What is the question? I'm sorry. Two dripping wet watermelons make me think of this. Farm? <laughs> We've been at farms all day. Uh, <clears throat> my favorite thing about my body is... My penis. Oh. My, your favorite thing about Dobby's body is... My dick, hey, my dick has thing. three Twitters. Really? Come on, bitch. Three Twitter. What does it say? What does your penis Dobby's say? Dick, Dobby's dick. Dobby's cock. Dobby's big yeah, fat. Just talking about it. You know, just hanging out. Just hanging out. <laughs> enjoying it. Chilling. Just chilling. <laughs> Fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice. Fuck your mother. Yeah. yeah. Uh, uh, uh. Do you hear that water? My voice is gone for some reason. I know. We asked you if you wanted oh, to water. Oh, yeah. I could use a water. Is that third drawer, third drawer, third drawer. <laughs> Get it done. Look at that, look at that. Gentlemen. Oh, Fiji. Like a you guys are water. gentlemen, wow. Gentlemen. I want to keep this forever. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Maybe. Don't check off in it. <laughs> it's a good thing I roofied it. <laughs> You're fucked, Mr. Stars. You're gonna end up like that bitch, see? <laughs> Soon done. Done. <laughs> yeah, we, we, we roofied her journey. <laughs> right. 
Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, what's going on? Oh, you yeah. ruined it. Hey, Dad, remember, get the... Roofies? Move the camera around. You got roofied. Cool. Cool. Having the first, first time? No. <laughs> <laughs> Every night? Some shit in my drink. <laughs> yeah. Every other night, about. Yeah. I'll give you a break at I'm once. getting pretty immune to it though, so they're gonna have to start slipping me some heavier shit. <laughs> <laughs> you shouldn't have told them that. Right. Nice um, let's go for that. Let's play some games. Ooh. Do would you guys? We should uh, we do this with a bunch of bands. We you prank call them. Okay. And we uh we try and come up with like a scheme. So like. Prank calling who? I wanna, well, I'm gonna say we're gonna call someone. Let's call uh, another band. We're gonna call a fan, one of your fans. Oh. And then we're gonna just you're gonna put up the prank, and then at the very end we'll tell them it's actually Bone Dance Floor. Uh. Interviewing. Got a lot of fucking notes here, huh? Not bad. I can't hold your shit down in your head. <laughs> you write it all down like a dick. That's and right. I just gotta back the bus up a little bit. Uh, oh, dude, we're cool. So we're gonna be moving. Back it on up. Yeah, back just, it up. Just, just about ten feet. Interviewing Blow on the Dance Floor. Tweet me That's numbers. Let's see how many we get. Right. Okay, we'll wait for that for a second. Did I go through? Yes, okay. Um, while we're waiting... E e I don't know what I'm doing. You like that? You're my math teacher. I am your math teacher. Okay, this is the longest interview in my life. It's gonna be your best one, though. What's the worst... Or, um, shit. God damn it. Here, you, you Why is my house questions. moving? Why is my house moving? Yeah, let's get a shot of the house moving. No, I think everyone can fucking see the house. <laughs> Describe 80 year old Jay. What's he like? Who, me? Yeah. <laughs> oh, no, I'm going to commit suicide at like 50. I don't want to see myself get old. Yeah? Yeah, no. So once you like kind of lose the lose the body. Yep. Yeah. It's all downhill. Are well, you going to have a. Let, let's be. Sh like, like, let's not joke around or nothing. I'm covered in tattoos. I'm going to look like a fucking. Uh, like, comic that just came out of the washer or something. Like, by the time I'm 80. <laughs> like, it's not going to be cute. So. Can you show us some of your tattoos? Like what? When were they? What, what's important? Like one of your favorites? This is the one I got for Evolution. That is my really Grim that. Reaper. This is my favorite. This is Blood on the Dance Floor. What I believe in. Uh -huh. I'm afraid of sharks, so I face my fear every single day. Uh, this is the motto I live by: No lies, just love. And uh, this is um, our old symbol to Blood on the Dance Floor. And this is Mickey Mouse. Ah. He was a symbol of independence, and I obsessed with bats. This is I achieve my dreams. This is I'm a monster tattoo. Every good there's evil. What and like what inspi what what makes you want to have all these tattoos? Um, they're all just symbols. They're all part of me. Mm -hmm. They all just it's like telling myself through my art. Yeah, man. So people can understand me before they even yeah get to it. And then this is all Final Fantasy VII, which represents oh. my childhood. So I'm a big anime nerd. What about yours? Do you have any cool ones? No, mine are all stick on. <laughs> Do you have, what's your favorite tattoo? Um, <clears throat> yeah, you know, it's, uh, I have the same one he does, the Blood and Dance Floor one, the oh, okay. little heart with the BOTD. I, I do like that one. It's one of my favorites. One of my favorites is actually on my thigh, which I can't even show you because I'm yeah. in a second skin. <laughs> I apologize. <laughs> it's all good, man. This is your second skin? Yeah. It's, it's very tight. It's, it's pretty tight. Yeah. What size is that? Um, it's like a zero. Size zero? Yeah. Um... If you two got married, how do you think that would play out? Me and Dobby? Yeah. Oh, yeah, we're already pretty much yeah, married. We're, we're pretty much married. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> it's, we don't need a ring. It's like yeah. being in a band together is, is marriage. And it's cool. He's like the best housewife. Yeah. 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 Jay. He cooks. I clean, you know. <laughs> True. You guys are a good team. Yeah, we, we, we're the dream team. There you go. Yeah, Jay, how do you think our marriage would work? Me and you? <laughs> yeah. Oh, my God. Once it's legal in Colorado. Like Chris Brown Rihanna thing. <laughs> Chris Brown Rihanna. Fucking. I'd be Chris Brown. <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah. And then my pussy can be Rihanna. <laughs> <laughs> Do you think we, could, we would get along? I don't know. If you beat me up enough, maybe. <laughs> Show you who's boss. I like to get beat. Ugh. Ugh, yeah. Take Ooh. that. Chris Brown. <laughs> Show the fuck out. I'm sorry. Yeah. So maybe put you on a fucking... Uh, House arrest again. Yeah, bitch. <laughs> well, this is my house, so we're good. Oh, can you get house arrest in a tour bus? That'd be pretty sweet. You can go wherever. Yeah, right. That would that would make no sense. I know. I, mean, I don't think you can do that. You have to get a dumb judge. Um, <laughs> no, too. Tell me about your first kiss. 
with a boy or a girl? Whichever one. My first kiss? Um, uh, I don't know. I was like in uh, sixth grade, I think. Mm -hmm. And I just kissed one of my friends. It was a girl. I see. Yeah. How was that for you? It yeah. It's pretty bad. Pretty bad? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Your first kiss is always I thought like... people were supposed to kiss like that, and then I kissed a boy and realized, oh, that's I, how you're supposed to kiss. Really, not to brag, but I am a pretty good kisser. Yeah? Oh, yeah. yeah? What's the secret? My lips. Yeah? Yeah, it's the lips. And don't go, like, mouth open, you know? Oh, I, don't, I don't have to do yeah. a lot of work. My yeah, lips, my lips just do the work exactly. for it. Exactly. Amen, girl. Like, I don't gotta do Angelina nothing. <laughs> like, you're too. such a good kisser. I was like, I feel like I don't put any effort into I know, I really it. Don't. Me too. You know, kinda, so easy. My lips do all the work. Yeah. yeah. I just put a little, a little love into it. <laughs> Coming on. K kiss the camera. Kiss the camera. Fuck the camera. <laughs> oh no. There you go. That's all it How does it look? It's pretty, pretty foggy. Ah, uh, do you guys have something to wipe uh, it off? Fuck yeah. that bitch out. <laughs> yeah. Do you have something to wipe it off? Yeah, I'm no, it's gonna scratch. It's gonna, it's gonna scratch. Yeah, it'll scratch. It'll scratch. What? Give a fuck. Boom. This is like kind of soft. There you go. See, that's why he's a house. And the car would move. Don't fall. This is why I don't do anything nice. Every time I do something nice, something bad happens. Javi gets or Jay gets up to do something nice. <laughs> he almost goes flying. <laughs> Why are we moving? I don't know. Why is my house moving? This Why is this happening to me? I'm gonna back your bad attitude up. Um, still in here? I thought you left. If you were an STD, can you get a shot of him driving over there? Yeah. If you were an STD, what STD would you be? What STD would you relate to? I would be herpes. Oh, look, he's driving. Actually, it looks like a ghost is doing it. You can't even see him. Close yeah. Up. <laughs> what? What is it? Dobby, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> what about champion of the world? Right, we are about finished, guys. Um, all right. What? SCB I drove right? seven hours. So I know. I, know, I would I know. be herpes because I would come back like a motherfucker. Exactly. Oh, there you go. Oh. Me three. Um, I think. Do you guys have a creepy like, or not creepy, but like a bar face? Like, what face do you make? Do we that already? Dude, I feel a like a bar gas. Face. Yeah, like what do you do when you when you're like you want to bang that guy right there? You're like, oh, like the oomph. Yeah, I like the probably, oomph. I think I would start gagging actually. Uh, <laughs> oh, oh, poor John. Uh, Jay would be like that guy. Yeah. All right, hold on. <laughs> <laughs> Ten minutes. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Five seconds later, yeah. terminated. <laughs> I'm Chi yeah, Pretty much, I just sniff him out, find the one I want, target it. I'm just like, it, damn! Um, mm, <laughs> Do your milkshakes bring all the boys in the air? Um, actually, you know, that's um, I'm going to the doctor about that. Apparently, it's not supposed right, to. Cool. My milkshakes bring too many boys to the yard. Oh yeah. So it's becoming a problem. Brought two on the bus right now. So, it, yeah. Apparently so. <laughs> <laughs> apparently so. I'm gonna give you this. Anything you wanna ask? All my questions. Look what he's done to my questions. Yeah. Right. All right. See, look. Wait, look, wait. There's wait, this. Is that, is that chapstick? Yeah. Dude, where is that? Wait, what? Wait, get up. About? Get up. Get up. That came out of my pocket. Napoleon Dynamite. <laughs> is it really? <laughs> chap aid. What? You rich He's got some chap aids. Yeah, I'm on uh, I'm on Accutane, which is like the it dries you out. So I. Oh my god, are you serious? Yeah, yeah. Don't do that. Oh, god, well, I'm almost girl. done. I have like one Stop more week left. All that dick. All right, how long have you been on it? A year. That's you. insane. Yeah, well, your skin looks great. Yeah, except Minus well, the burn these, these don't. I hope, I hope we don't have to pump your your stomach full of cum like little Kim. <laughs> That'd be very tragic. We're <laughs> gonna pump his ass full of cum. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I don't doubt it either. In the grave. That's right. Well, yeah. look, oh. we want to end the we want to we want to <laughs> end the note. We want to end it with uh, the prank you know, call. Sing our love to our fans. We're gonna prank call this motherfucker. Yeah. And then we, we just want to remind everybody. Yeah, that we're good. That's we, that we've done race, plenty. And that is the human race. We love you. We Thank love you. you. All right, we're hearts up. Get your heart on. Get, Get your, your heart, heart on. on. I actually can only do it with one hand. So if someone <laughs> says this, yeah. here, baby, I'll, I'll complete it. Yay. I'll complete it. Yay, my other Yay. hand. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> <laughs> Jay, I feel like if we do it, like electricity will spark because it's such. Right? Just like. Hey, hey! Ah!
Did your mother ever tell you tits or get the fuck out? <laughs> That's right. All right, you guys, you ready for a phone number? You guys gonna pick who we're gonna call? All right, let's just. What what prank do you want to do? Whatever first number pops up. What prank? What are we doing? What are yeah, we what do? we gonna we're gonna try and convince them? They stole our dog. They had sex with our girlfriend or boyfriend. Oh, okay. Uh, we can just say. Uh, How about I can't believe you cheated on me. Oh yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. After that night. Okay, so we can do. Let's do. Um, Courtney. She says I feel like cl crying if I don't. If we don't. All right, we gotta call her. There's some pressure. Okay. What zero seven eight? What the fucking area code is that? The best one. Okay, here we go. Yeah, I hope this number works. I'm sorry, but I think it's really dumb to post your number on Twitter. <laughs> they, want just, they just want to talk to you. This is a bad idea. When is this going to work? Please dial the number you want. She, pro the? she probably did it. Maybe the zero's by accident. Yeah. I think you fucked that one up pretty good. Yeah, that's, that's fine. It's cool. Come in. I think 078's oh, Korea or something. <laughs> Let's try this. Seven yeah, this is it. Okay, here we go. Here we go. He's ready? Yeah, let's go. Okay, you're gonna convince that you're, yeah. che you're cheating. Okay. I got this girl. What the f <sighs> All right. Pay your phone bill, bitch. <laughs> Pay your phone bill. Pay your phone bill. Um. Damn! Damn! It's... I'm trying to find one that actually... Okay, I hate when people don't do the number right. You love my hair, don't you? It feels like a Chia pet. It is a Geo pet. Ch -ch -ch chia Okay, here we go. Oh, shit! You just come back. Yeah. That's right. New Jersey too. Mm, here we go. Jersey. Jersey. She said she's gonna freak out if you call. Talking about. Oh What's my god. coffee? Oh my god. Seahorses forever. Seahorses forever. Ever horrible Jersey accent. Get ready. Get ready. She's probably nervous. <laughs> come on. I'm like. <laughs> Uh. Girl, where were you last night? Uh. Where were you last night? Girl. Yeah, girl, where the fuck were you last night? Where the fuck is Bitch, don't be playing no motherfucking games. Where the fuck were you? Nine o'clock. Don't even fucking trip, nigga, because I fucking map quested. All right, it takes you eight minutes to get to the house. You got there in six minutes. Wrong person, Fuck you, motherfucker. You know what? I'll come on your dad's face. <laughs> I don't know. That was the part where we're supposed to tell him. By the way. That's because he's so used to people calling him from block number. We love. We love everyone. Well, there you go, guys. Blow on the dance floor. I did promise one last thing. People, a couple of our fans wrote really deep messages to you. I said I would read them. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> 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 oh, fuck, man. I'm sorry, I haven't showered in three days. Damn, your dick tastes like cheese. Your dick tastes like Cheetos. <laughs> okay, um, that's actually a mean one. I don't want to read. Well, actually, you guys yeah. want to hear a mean one? Let's do it. You guys are two f words who have no talent. Two faggots who have no talent. A talent. Who ruined music? A talent. Go to fucking stop making music and that's touring talent. because your gay asses are turning other kids gay. Half of your fans are 80% chicks. <laughs> When did that become a fucking problem? <laughs> I like having girls as our fans. Ladies are awesome. Oh, there's more. There's the more. The only reason they listen to you is because you talk about sex in half of your songs. The last time I checked, men were the ones with the high testosterone level that were obsessed with sex. Not girls. Girls like it's because we're pretty. <laughs> yeah. There you go. I'm going to let you read that, a nice word. Great, dude. That was good. What do, you wanna, what do you want to say to Samuel Kajaralaguri? What? I really don't have anything to say to people like that because they're so like. How about this? Here's one for you. I don't, what, dear Dobby J, I found out, I found you guys in a dark spot in my life. My friend showed me you. Somehow you guys always seem to boost up my spirits so that I forget some of the problems I go through. And I have a question for Jay. Are you Wiccan? I saw you wearing a pentagram at Warps. <laughs> no, I'm a I'm an aesthetic Satanist actually. Yeah. So one time. 
Yeah. Jay was really drunk in downtown, and he met a Hayes, Hell's Angel. Okay. And it wasn't like a really nice confrontation. Yeah, he started fucking with me, and then I, I was I was wasted though. I was wasted, but this is just the story I heard the next day. Uh, the Hell's Angel was just like, oh, I'll fucking fight you or kill you or some shit like that, and I was like, I was like, oh yeah, he's like I'm a Hell's Angel. I was like, fuck Hell's Angels, I'm Satan, bitch. And I was like, God, I could have just got murdered just then. <laughs> I could have just got murdered. I could have just got here's murdered. A, here's a nice one for you. Hi, Jay. Hi, Davi. I would like to tell you that a lot of people bully me in school for listening to you guys and liking the music that I do. Sometimes I think whenever I started listening to you guys, and the first night that I heard of you guys, I was going to take my life. But then guess whose music stopped me? If it didn't listen to you guys that night, I wouldn't be here. Sorry, their spelling is really bad. Um, <laughs> and wouldn't be living my life through you. I honestly, from the bottom of my heart, want to thank you for all your amazing music that you've put out and giving me thank hope. You. Yeah. Well, no, thank you. I think that's the gist of it. But yeah, yeah you saved this girl's life. On a serious note, I mean... I wish I could, like, go to school with this girl and beat the fuck out of these people. Yeah, you pay do? Some on her. I just pull my I dick really out and would. piss all over them. I hate people. I, I don't really understand. Would. Like, why I pick up a trash can and beat the shit out? somebody who's so... Like, it's a child. Like, she's, mm -hmm. like, a little 13-year-old girl or however old she is. You know, it's just, like, it's fucked up. Yeah, dude. Welcome to my home. <laughs> this is my bed. Yes. You'll see my bed. Okay, that's my uh, Techno Body Viking. What's up, dude? He's Techno Viking. Techno Viking, huh? So, yeah. Okay. Slip not shirt. <laughs> Rock on. Yeah, we're just chilling here. That's uh, that's my bed. I got my guitar there, my laptop. Roses this for my girl for the date tonight. Oh, yeah. Can you sh sh pick that up and show it? Dude, look at these roses. Like, smell, Damn. smell that. Look at that. Wow. Those are some pretty. She's a lucky girl. I mean it. Yeah. And then I got lots of chocolate. Oh wow. Yes. So yeah, this is your this is room. My bed. That's my sheets. You got your guitar over there. It's my magic rock. Oh, you have a magic rock. I have a magic rock. Well, how, I, why is I, it magical? Well, basically, before I go to bed, I hold it uh -huh. every night. I think of the best thing that happened to me that day, and I say thank you, and I go to sleep. Wow, that's great. So, and like, I'm oh, sorry, go ahead. Yeah. And no, 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 it's pretty cool. But uh, yeah, this is my this is my room, and then these are everybody's bunks. Being in front of me. I feel like I'm on tour. <laughs> <laughs> I am on tour. You are. Do you still want these? Oh, yeah, I'll take them. Thank There's you. like two of them are like torn. Oh, it's fine. Don't worry about it. Yeah, this is just where we sleep. I got DVDs. I got Xbox mm -hmm. up in here. I'm going to get the Xbox. Xbox. Get some DVDs. Get surround sound. Yeah. Pretty cool. It's really hard to stand Blink 182, Aretha, Frank, your Chronicle. Ah, in where, there. where do you sleep, Jay? Right Pirates here. later. In, in this room? Yeah, oh. I'm smoking. Okay, show us your bunk. Why it's dirty. <laughs> it's a little dirty right Is now. Is that a cow in there? A cow. Or no, never mind. It's like a. No, that's the sheets. Oh, that's my zebra blanket. I thought you had a cow in your bunk. Mm -mm. Is that a cow in your Jack bunk? Jack Daniel's bandana. <laughs> you know. This, this is where I keep all my liquor. I have like. Oh, wow. Yeah, I have a big bottle. Dude, of I tea. killed that whole bottle of Jack last night. Look at this book. This is what, this is what we're going to drink from. So, what, what's, what's your poison, Jack Daniel's? Jack. Uh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> you like Jack? Yeah. I, I like Bailey's too. There you go. Bailey. You know, like 80s rock stars that would drink his whiskey. And stuff. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Cool, man. Yeah. All right, that's it. That's, that's sweet. Room. Awesome. Well, yeah, I guess we're going to end the video here because I don't have anyone else to do it. So thank you guys. Um, any last words? Um, come in my mouth. What are you doing right now? I'm getting ready. Yeah? Uh -huh. What's the secret to... Uh... Can we kill him? Me? Secret to what? I don't know. Your style. Kind of. Um, honestly, I just wear, like, stage makeup, basically, when I'm on stage. It's really, really different. I use an airbrush to put it on. Okay. So, it's pretty dramatic, but <laughs> everything goes by really fast, so I get my shit done quick. I had, didn't realize this many people were here. You guys are fucking huge. I've never been to one of your shows, so. Oh, really? Yeah, this is the first oh, yeah. time. I don't play no game. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. It's great. See, maybe you should be nicer to us, Brian. I have been nicer to you. <laughs> Lie. Uh huh. Oh, don't eat lucky turns in front of me, you faggot. Uh huh. I'm on a diet. <laughs> Who's on a diet? Me. How much do you weigh? Um, I don't know, but I'm about five pounds away from my birth weight, and I'm really fucking excited. <laughs> <laughs> Where's your daddy? <laughs> Where's your daddy? Oh, my dad? Yeah, who's gonna protect you now? Oh, I don't need protection. <laughs> I'm a, I'm a, you don't need protection. That's I'm how a black belt. <laughs> oh, that's a good one. Should I map myself out or leave it shiny? Because I feel like if I don't, it's going to go everywhere. 
If you don't make it shiny? If I don't mat it. If I mat it. We'll mat it then. We'll mat it. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna go mat Do it. Do we have any ice? Uh, I don't even know what ice is. Just hanging around my neck? No. Oh, okay. Just kidding. Bling tattooed bling. on. Oh, you fooled me. I can put it in the freezer. I'm so gangster, my ice is tattooed on. Honestly, I don't think Jay needs security. He's pretty scary on his own. I don't. He's not my security guard. He's not like for me. Oh, okay. I work for Dobby. I don't work for him. That's what everyone says, though. They're like, they're like, are you Jay's security guard? I'm like, no, he doesn't need one. <laughs> <laughs> Have you ever had to deal with a crazy fan? Yeah, but they're just awesome. <laughs> yeah, you like. I bet you would like. They're that. just crazy awesome. No, there was this one girl that bit me at work. Before. That was a little what? Intense, but was, what? I was doing. I was doing a Where signing. Where she bite you? And on, in the middle of my chest. She was like a little small girl and um, was doing a signing. She comes up to me and she's bawling her eyes out because she gets to meet me or whatever. And I'm like, oh, that's so cute, you know? So I like reach in and give her a hug to console her, you know? And I got her head right here and I'm like petting her head. Bitch just fucking straight up bites the shit. You want me to unzip that? No, you're good. <laughs> I got it. Yeah, what she said. Bitch just straight up <laughs> bit the shit out of me, like right here. I was like, oh! Are you like fucking kidding me? If you had been on. There had, fucking news. If there had right. been if there had been blood and you had been on a dance floor. Oh just stop right there. Hey, hey. Yep. I'm gonna need you to like it to pull my laptop. Your heart and love is I destroy the end of you. So, so easily fooled you little boy to think it's true. There you go. Yeah, that's a shit. You warming up? Fuck my face. Yeah. Fuck my face. Not in your face. <laughs> oh, I hate burning my tongue and shit. Are you a smoker? I mean, do you regularly smoke, I guess? What do you mean? Like, do you smoke a lot? I'm a, I'm a medicinal patient of marijuana, so yes, I smoke every day. <laughs> <laughs> Medical marijuana. This is Mrs. Vanity. Hey. Hi. Are you the one you bought the roses for? Yeah. You're pretty. Thank you. Lucky man. That's right. <laughs> you all, you changed your eyes. What's on your head? Huh? What's on your head? What's on your head? What's on my head? A hood. A hood. That's a hood. Oh, your hat's on under there. I was like, your hair ain't that big. Uh. <laughs> I was like, ain't no way in hell. I was like, you just something on your head. It's not a tumor. Aw, so romantic. It's my it's Miss Vanity. <laughs> what do you love about Dobby? Me? Oh my god, don't put me on the camera. <laughs> okay. <well. laughs> Why are you so photogenic? <laughs> you know, Photogenic's you a little... You have not one thing to say that's good about me. I do, are we going? Things. Oh, so. Are we, are we going, Dobby? Oh, what's going on? Oh, I called you Davy for the longest time. Yes, I love you, Davey. <laughs> love my right hand, man. Do a lot of people call you Davy? Hey, we've got the key to this bitch. Not me! Alright. Showtime! You guys excited? Oh, yeah. Yes. Oh, okay. You look excited. Oh. And we are headed to the stage. I still can't figure out if they like me or not, but I like them. That was really cheesy. Motherfucker. Are you excited? Do you still get nervous but, when... Yeah, every time. It's like a boy going to Disney World. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Sorry. You get some water. Yeah? It does body good. What kind of water is it? It's uh, smart water. Smart water? <laughs> to make you smarter? No, I'm already smart, but... Smarter. Uh -huh. But it's wiser. Dude, where, do, where do I get contacts you, like that? You get, you get dehydrated on stage. Yeah, I believe it, dude. Um, Altaparel.net. It's oh, we're okay. sponsored by them, so we get free contacts. Dude, that's, that's fucking awesome. It's awesome. I never had to pay for contacts ever again. 
Gabrielle Curry, remind me. I go on stage and whisper that. Where's my whale? Right there. All right, cool. I'm gonna crowd surf in that thing tonight. Yeah, who? What is that? I've been wondering all night. It's an orca whale. There's a orca it's a killer whale. It's a killer whale. I'm gonna kill some people today in the crowd. Damn. <laughs> Dude, that's legit. Mother of mercy, come to me. Awake my soul, set me free. Reveal that power for all to see. Consume all fear that lies in me. Radiance at your violet flame. Expand and blaze the light in me. Energize my mind and heart with all love, all power, all peace. Amen. 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 Hands up. Yeah. All right. Nine love. I, I didn't. I thought I was gonna have you film it. I was. I was gonna have you film that, but oh well. So behind this line is cool. On the other side, cool. Do some sit up, right? Here. Going up front. Hold on the fucking dance, dude. The man. They're calling for you, dude. Oh my god, I'm nervous.
motherfuckers, but I have a boner in my pants right now. Don't worry, there's plenty more where that came from. Come with me behind the scenes, backstage, and onto the tour bus to meet your favorite stars. Hey, what's up, you guys? We're hanging out here with Asking Alexandria, the very tired all-time low. You're hanging out here with Black Veil Brides. I'll ask questions you've never heard before and get you the answers you won't find anywhere else. You said you're a Justin Timberlake fan. No. No? No. Maybe that wasn't you? Oh my god, I shouldn't have smoked all that weed. How long is this nose you have here? I have no idea. Happy so birthday, dear Bri. Ha, 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 ha. I am a ninja. You need to know. Ninja! Oh. If you were a porn star, what would your name be? Mine would definitely just be the jackhammer. <laughs> <laughs> Our new song, you know, right? Uh, party like it's. Oh, God, oh, God. Like my balls, yeah. You guys see my balls? You know, and they're like, wee! <gasps> All right. <laughs> I'm like crying. He's crying. Thumbs up, comment, and subscribe for brand new videos every day. Reporting for YouTube, I'm Brian Stars. Brian Stars! Brian Stars! I'm the reason you're, you go on tour. You're the reason I'm here, baby.